What's up guys, welcome back to another video, hope you're all doing well today. Today we have got probably the first video on my channel without an engine. Um, we're playing a bit of Descenders, now I, I literally hopped on Steam and saw that the game was free to play for the next three days. Uh, I recorded this on the 17th of February, so unfortunately by the time the video goes out it probably isn't free anymore. However, I believe it is still on discount until the 24th of Feb, so if you've been interested in picking it up, um, but have pulled it off, then feel the, go ahead and do it. Uh, it's a pretty solid game, however, you will soon find out from the gameplay, gameplay that you're about to see that I should really stick to my games that involve motorbikes rather than uh, rather than bikes because god damn was it painful. Um, regardless, I hope you enjoy the video as always. Um, it is a good fun game. I imagine once you get all the controls down it's a really really good fun overall anyway. Um, but yeah, enjoy the video. Well, I wasn't 100% sure what I was doing, to be honest with you boys, on the homepage of this game, so I, I think what I've just done is joined a custom kind of compoundy type area. Um, I, I mean, I'm guessing people have been here before, they know where they're going, someone's just zoomed off over there. Um, but we're just going to just have a ride around and see how it goes, really. Um, first impressions of this game, just purely from the very small tutorial, you might have seen me uh, going around it on the intro there. It's it's very, very fast paced. I didn't expect it to be as fast as it is, but of course it is quite an uh, arcade type game. Uh, I myself, as far as mountain biking goes, uh, especially like downhill mountain biking, hang on. Oh, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh my god, okay. So what I've noticed as well is, uh, even in the tutorial, I actually, I crashed in the tutorial, embarrassingly enough. Um, but you can't respawn like where you are. You have to spawn back at the top of the trail, which might get a bit awkward on this. I'm hoping that I haven't got to respawn too many times as I just try... <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh shit, you can have first person. Hang on. Hang on. Should you try first person for it? Yeah, let's try first person for a little bit. See how... Oh god, I can imagine this is going to be quite... Um... Oh god, quite difficult to control. Sorry, I'll take my time. I'm in no rush. Um, but sorry, as far as mountain biking experience goes, I don't have a whole lot. Now, being from the... Um, I'm from the southeast of the UK, and there's not a whole lot in terms of elevation around here for you to even build a bike park. Um, there's one that's maybe like 30, 40 minute drive from me, but it's very, very basic. There's no, definitely no like black trails and things like that. It's all, all really greens for the most part uh, and a, a little bit of single track as well. So uh, mountain biking is something that I do actually enjoy when I, I get to do it. It's just purely a case of there not being much around at all. And especially the weather in the UK as well is never great. But um, I see videos on YouTube of um, people like, is it, uh, it's uh, Seth, Seth Spike Hex and riding around whistler and things like that and it just looks so much fun i didn't get anywhere near clearing that Where's, let's see where see where this guy's gonna go because he's just like yeeting down this is he just going straight oh my god he's just going a straight line all right send it back flip oh this is that is i can't oh he's got stabilizers on his bike as well that's sick let's go in the more of a oh no i don't want that that aerial let's go here we'll see if we can oh please survive is there anywhere else i, can... I don't think there's anywhere else i can go up on the straight but oh that's, that's no it's a little trail over there hang on Skirt! break let's go this way here we go. Let's get going over here. Maybe that. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. Oh, if there's a jump, but it. Oh, over that. Yeah, I definitely did a lot more speed there. That wasn't the way you start that. Um, but yeah, I, I, this this kind of leads back to the point that I've mentioned on a few uh, MX videos of kind of being jealous as far, uh, as far as like the US is concerned, as far as like space and land, because there's just not enough of that over here, and I feel like it's so limiting in terms of outdoor sports. Uh, I mean, if you want to do a sport outdoors rep in the UK, it just, it just seems to be football slash obviously soccer for you guys. I'm not going to get into that sort of debate. Please don't start that argument in the comments. Um, that literally seems to be the only real outdoor sport that you've got like good access to, which is quite sad when you come to think of it. Um, you yeah, know, it's, it's something that I've always really enjoyed. I need to at some point um, drag Charlie out because he's got a bike, and I, I don't know why we don't go and do it. Just chuck the bikes in the back of the car or the van and. We'll go and uh, go and have a ride. That's not something I would put on a GoPro because, it, honestly, the the trails down here are so so boring in compared uh, like compared to what you see on Whistler. And I, I don't think I'd even have the balls to be able to do some of them jumps those boys do. They are absolutely massive, uh, unless I had an engine between my legs. And so, like, somehow, any time that I properly try jumping a bike like bicycle, like any any bike that hasn't got an engine, no matter what I do, no matter what age I am when I do it. No matter how careful I am when I jump, I always, one, one way or another, manage to 
somehow slip a peg and just absolutely destroy my bollocks on the frame <laughs> every single time I'll go home with like and I, I worry how like, I wonder sometimes how I don't bloody pop a pop a nut but it's um my, my skills on a bike are very very like buster um funny enough though uh which again something why I'm not sure I don't do more often I could like, maybe like a two minute walk from me like literally walking distance there is a bmx track that has, that's been built so not far at all you know it's got the proper gate and everything um so yeah if the time ever came that i wanted to get into that i've got plenty of access to do so i mean it'd be pretty good for um as far as fitness goes because i am struggling right now i went uh, i went out last night and played uh seven side football it was on like uh, astroturf like 4g type pitch so uh but not a, not a proper oh god i'm gonna crash that's annoying i felt like i was so far down there as well um and it, it just proved to me how how unfit i am right now lockdown has not been good to me um i, I must have ran for like 10 minutes and then started absolutely blowing out of my ass like hands hands on my knees gasping for breath but it was really really good fun it's really nice to kind of get out again and properly socialize with people because it's been such a long time i've just been stuck in this room 24 7 and i'm hoping that it's something that we can do a bit more uh, a bit more frequently because everyone had a good time uh, i think about two minutes from the end i uh, i pulled up I, I got the worst 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 cramp i've ever had in my entire life in my right calf it was awful it didn't shift for like a good a good five minutes and i had to get someone to like stretch my leg out for me oh it was so painful i do not wish that on anybody like i've had i've had a fair few cramps in my life doing motocross you know after you uh, you take your boots off after your day's riding and you try stretching your legs out and you stretch it just that little bit too far and your calf goes for like a split second and you manage to like Un unstretch yourself just in time before it fully takes hold um but yeah no no luck like that yesterday i like, people seem to be jumping off here and landing somewhere i don't know if i'm just being an absolute noob which i probably am i mean i don't know the physics well at all but i am probably making this look a whole lot worse than it actually is right you know what let's go somewhere else end track yes continue we'll try oh we got total wipeout tracks boys you screw it, I'm trying this. Screw actual downhill mountain biking. Jesus Christ. Let's try this out. Oh, there's a lot of people in here. Would you just I guess we just Oh god, I'm not gonna make it. Okay, I need to time that a bit better. Okay, it's not it doesn't like reset, it's just like a constant constant spin. Let's try it. Get through it. Oh, I didn't have enough speed. Oh god, you gotta time this so well. Hang on, hang on, hang on. This could be more difficult than I first anticipated. Get over it. There we go. Try and like stretch whip it as if it's reflex. But, um, yeah, this this game, at, at time recording this, I think it's only going to... Oh, my God. It's only going to last um, for the next three days, I believe, at the, at the point of recording this. Um, but it is free to play right now. It's on discount until the 24th, but it's free to play for the next three days, which I think today's the 17th I'm recording this. So, unfortunately, by the time that the video comes out, it will actually be... You will have to pay for it again. But, yeah, it's the only reason I downloaded it, because I can't imagine myself playing it very much. Um, it's, it's not my... Uh, like type of game for the most part <laughs> I like my motorbikes I like my engines and I don't think I can get over that jump I have no idea how you go like faster <laughs> that's not it all right we're just gonna we're gonna sit here and spin but um overall Descenders it's okay it's one of them games that I would probably prefer watching good people play than play myself it's not a bad game by any means just just not for me and I think it might be the first game on this channel that I've played outside of live streams that is purely videos that uh, doesn't have any engines still got two wheels of course but uh, no engines this time around but i don't know let me know if you enjoyed this video i don't think i'll be playing it again it was just nice to play it while it was free to play uh, let me know if you do play it and uh, why i am such a complete noob and crashing everywhere and yeah that'll do it for me i hope you've enjoyed this video if you did as always I hope you drop a like on the video. Really, really helps get it out to more and more people, and I really, really appreciate it. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please drop a sub. Uh, it really, really helps the channel grow, and we're very, very close to 23k. We might hit 23k by the time this video comes out. I'm at about 22.8 at the time I'm making the video. Um, and yeah, that'll do it for me. I hope you have a lovely rest of the day, whatever it is that you guys are up to, and I'll tell you, catch you guys in the next video. Peace. My tent way too damn dark. Laugh in your face like man dark. Came a long way from the bad days way back. Had to burn down that landmark. Seen some things I ain't really want to see. It's all good. That's what made me me. Now who would I be if I had it easy? Used to break down. Now I'm in a 350. Like whoa. I've been laying way too low. Had to switch up and change my flow. Cause I'm back from the block. Had to bust some rocks and dust off the dust. And get back in the box. Now why you want to?